Hey, Auntie Joyce. How are you? Uh, hello. Uh, can you hear me, dear? Yeah, I can hear you. Oh, wonderful. This new space age communication device is just lovely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it sure is. So, Auntie, are you still free for tea this afternoon? Of course, dear. Great. I'm going to pop out a bit later and pick up a cake for us. That's the door. I gotta go. I'll see you later, Auntie Joyce. Goodbye. Goodbye, dear. Uh, Derek, uh, how do I turn this thing off? Oh, oh yes, I see. <laughs> Hi, how can I help? Hi there. You take in stray dogs, right? Yeah, I do. Well, I don't think he's a stray, as he has a collar, but he certainly isn't mine. Okay, come on in and I'll see what I can do. Thanks. So where did you find him? Well, believe it or not, I found this dog in my butcher shop, eating all my product. Oh no, that's terrible. Yes, I was not very pleased at all. Anyways, I thought you could find his owner. I would be happy to. I'll look after him and keep him safe. Wow, he's a big fella, huh? I'm not surprised after seeing him eat all that today. Yeah, well thank you for bringing him to me. No worries. Have a good day. I better get back and restock. Okay, take care. Goodbye. So you have certainly had an adventure today, huh? What's your name, honey? Let's have a look at your collar here. Uh, ah, oh, Bailey. Haha, <laughs> cute name. Hey, where are you going, Bailey? Bailey? Ooh, food. Are you going to finish that? Uh, who are you? I'm Bailey, and I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten since the last time I ate. Hi, Bailey. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. That food smells so good. Oh, there you are, Bailey. I wondered where you got off to. Anyways, come over here and I'm going to put you next to Tink, okay? And then I'll go get you some breakfast. Ooh, breakfast! Okay, Bailey, this will be your pen. Tink's going to look after you, okay? I'll be right back with some food. Are you going to finish that food? Oh, um... Amy is bringing you some. I wish you would hurry up. I'm so hungry. That pug sure likes his food. Yeah, poor guy. He must be starving. I'm not too sure about that. Here you go, baby. I can't imagine you'd be very hungry after this morning's adventure. Uh, but here's some breakfast anyway. Wow, Bailey. You really like to eat, huh? Well, I'm going to go downstairs and make some doggy farm posters and try and track down your owner. Have a good breakfast, okay? Mm. Mm. This is good. Wait, what about dessert? Okay, let's see here. Found pug. A pug has been found in Greenfield Bitches and has been handed to Amy's pet store at the lake. Then I just put my number. And now all I'm missing is a picture of Bailey. Okay, Bailey, I'm going to take your picture and put it on the poster so we can hopefully track down your owner, okay? So, smile! <laughs> Good job, Bailey! Now, let's just upload his picture. Oh, great, that looks awesome! Now to print these off and distribute these around town. Oh, I know, maybe I can take Kenzie. I've got to pick up Auntie Joyce's cake too. Wow, it's a pretty busy day today. I should have a spare lead in here somewhere. Oh, here we go. Hey, Kenzie, fancy coming and walk with me? <coughs> ah, good boy. Okay, Bailey, I'm going to run out and do some errands. Don't worry, you'll be safer with the others. They will look after you. I'll see you when I get back. Come on then, Kenzie. Ah, oh, they're all printed. Perfect. We have lots to do, boy. We've got to put these posters up all around town and hope we find Bailey's owner. We've also got to pick up a cake for my tea with Auntie Joyce. And I've also got to go to the bank later. So much to do. Well, I guess there's no point waiting around. Are you ready, boy? <laughs> Let's go. Hey, Kenzie, is that okay if I put this lead on you? <coughs> ah, good boy, Kenzie.
this looks like a good place for a poster. What do you think, Kenzie? <coughs> ah, you're right. Let's put one up. Oh, yeah, that looks great. Well, that's one down. Only about a hundred more to go. Let's go, buddy. Hey, Baxter, want to go talk to the new guy? Sure. Let's go find out his story. So, Bailey, how come you're here? Are you a stray dog too? No, I have an owner. He should be picking me up soon. We were playing fetch when I got distracted by something magical. Okay, Bailey, you ready? We're gonna play fetch, okay? You gotta bring it back, okay? And fetch! Go get it, boy! <sighs> come on, Bailey! You can do it! Bailey, come on! <sighs> okay, let's try this again. Right? See the stick? Okay, when I throw it, bring it back. Okay? And fetch! Bailey, seriously? You're like the laziest dog ever. Okay, we're gonna try this one more time, okay? I know you can do it. Go get it, boy! Come on, Bailey! You can do it! Ugh, Bailey! We've been over this a million times. You gotta go fetch the stick. All of a sudden, I could smell bacon, sausages, ham, chicken. I couldn't resist. I followed the smell, and I think I found heaven. I looked in the window and could see the most beautiful sight anyone could ever see. All the food a pug could eat. Mmm. I snuck into the store and I tried to resist. I really did, but I was so hungry after my first breakfast, I just couldn't starve myself any longer. And then I found the ham. The yummiest smelling ham I have ever smelled. And that's when the man came. What, what, what in the world? What is going on here? How did you get in here? You've eaten everything. Don't you dare. I'm warning you, dog. You leave the ham alone. Don't you even think about it. Right, that does it. I'm gonna take you to the pound. They'll know what to do with you there. But instead, I'm gonna take you to the pet shop. Come on. I'm here, but I sure am hungry though. Wow, Bailey, uh, that's quite a story. This is the last poster, Kenzie. There we go. Hopefully Bailey's own will spot these and contact us. This is it, Kenzie. This is the cake store. Oh, wow. Doesn't it smell amazing? Oh, wow. Look at all these cakes in there. Okay, buddy. I'm going to tie you up outside here, okay? I won't be long. Be good now. Ah, 
Ah, oh, look at all these cakes! But I wonder which one is the best one for Auntie Joyce? Hello there, can I help you? Ah, oh, yeah! I'm looking for a cake for my auntie. I'm visiting her later today. Oh, lovely! Well, I have a large range of cakes available, all baked here. And they all look so yummy! What do you recommend? Well, you can't go wrong with a Victoria sponge. I have one that's just finished baking in the oven. Mmm, yeah, I can smell it. It smells amazing. Here we are, dear. This will be perfect. I know that she loves cherries. Wonderful. Let me box this up for you. I hope your auntie enjoys the cake. I'm sure she will. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. Thank you, dear. Goodbye. I got the cake, Kenzie. Auntie Joyce is going to love it. Let's get home. today boy it was nice to spend some time out of the pet store huh and look at this cake mmm smells delicious auntie Joyce is gonna love it are you tired boy why don't you head upstairs and take a nap I'm sure the others have missed you hey Kenzie you're back I missed you yeah oh had a real nice walk but boy, I could do with a nap. You read my mind, boy. <laughs> I smell cake. Oh, I forgot to go to the bank. Oh, darn it. Okay, if I go now, I can still make it. Hey, dogs, I've got to go out for an hour, okay? Look after the pet shop for me. Mmm, that smells delicious. Maybe if I could have just a teeny tiny piece. Mmm, mm. this is the most delicious cake I've ever had. Mmm, but to be sure, maybe I should have another piece. Oh, yeah, I can confirm this is the best cake ever. Oh, but what's that? Oh, a piece of hair on that slice? Uh, I better eat that too. I don't want Amy eating hairy cake. Oh, that's strange. I wonder where Bailey is. Kenzie, are you awake? Huh? Uh, yeah. What's up? It's Bailey. He's gone. What do you mean, gone? Well... I woke up from my nap, and he's not here. His pen is open. Okay, well, he couldn't have gone far. Uh, let's have a look for him. Good idea. Bailey, what are you doing? Uh-oh. You're eating Amy's cake. Oh, no. What are we going to do, Kenzie? I don't know, Tink. Amy bought that for her aunt. She was really looking forward to giving it to her. I tried to resist. I really did. But then I saw the golden sponge, the shiny icing, those big red cherries. Bailey! I'm sorry. It's just too good. Want to try some? No! There's only one piece left. Don't even think about it. Yoink! Bailey! Mmm. So, so good. 
So very good. It's all gone. What are we going to do? Amy will be so upset. She might get rid of us. Now, she would never do that. But we don't want her feeling sad. We have to replace that cake. I have an idea. I'm sorry, guys. I really am. I just... It was too good. You really should have tried it. Bailey, go upstairs and go take a nap. Can't I help at all? And let you into the baker's? <laughs> no way. Go upstairs, Bailey. Okay, I'm going. Did, did, did you say baker's? Yep, we are going to go back and get another one. What? Come on! Kenzie, wait! Come on, Tink, we gotta go! Oh, I'm scared. There is nothing to be scared of, okay? I will keep you safe. I promise. Trust me? I trust you. Then let's go! We're here. I have a plan. Listen up. Okay, Tink, now! What's going on? Leave that little dog alone. I'm warning you, I will take you straight to the pound. Come here right now. Ooh, you cheeky dog. Get back here. Which one was it again? Oh yes, this looks like the right cake. You got it? Yeah, I've got it. Then let's get out of here. Well, seems like that little dog forgave him pretty fast. Now, back to my cakes. <gasps> wow, that was crazy. I thought she was going to catch me. But you did great, Tink. I'm really proud of you. <laughs> oh, thank you, Kenzie. Come on, we got to get back. <gasps> oh, no. Quick, Tink, hide! What is it, Kenzie? Amy is over there. She's almost home. We have to get back before she does. Oh dear. How are we going to do that? We have to run. Fast and stay hidden. Okay, Tink, you have to create a diversion. Go around the corner and bark. Um, uh, okay. And bark loud, Tink! Hey, what's all that barking? It sounds like someone's in trouble. Hello? Anyone there? Don't be afraid, hello? That's weird, there's no one here. Good job. Tink, put the cake on the desk and hurry! Oh, there we go! Come on! Let's go up the stairs! Hey dogs, I'm back! Did you do it? Did you replace it? Yeah, all done. Don't even think about going downstairs. I won't. I learnt my lesson. Okay, 
so let's check if there's any messages about Bailey. Hmm, I can't see any messages. Oh wait, that's the door! Hi, how can I help? Hi, I'm here about the pug Bailey. Oh, you are? Fantastic! Come on in! Thanks! I found your posters. My son has been heartbroken. He's just so attached to that dog. Ah, well luckily he's safe and sound. He's upstairs, come on up! Bailey, there you are! I've been worried sick about you! Zack has missed you so much! I'm so glad you saw the posters! It's always wonderful to reunite pets with their owners, and he's been such a good boy. I'm sure he has. Come on, Bailey, let's go home. <laughs> there we go, Bailey. I'll meet you guys back downstairs. Come on, buddy. Zack is still out looking for you. I'm going home, guys. Congratulations, Bailey. Good job, Bailey. No hard feelings? Not at all, buddy. You certainly gave us a day to remember. Goodbye, guys. Nice meeting you all. Bye, Bailey. Goodbye, kid. Go easy on the food. I will, sir. Bye! Thank you so much for looking after him. You are very welcome. It's what I do. Bailey, I'm gonna miss you, little guy. But I'm so glad you get to go home to your family. Don't run off again, okay? Thanks again, Amy. Have a good night. Good night. Well, Bailey, you must be starving. <laughs> I sure am going to miss that little guy. Oh, what time is it? Oh, I better get to Auntie Joyce's house. Okay, let's box up this cake. There we go. And good night, doggies. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night, okay?